and big decisions to make. 17 million. 17 million. Only 400k left behind. We still have. Wow, those wow. jacks are gone in see? a heartbeat. See? Here we go. And Ryo makes the call. Well, Ellie's okay. going to see that his jacks would have actually been ahead. We've got an absolutely massive showdown on our hands. Here comes the flop. Oh, there it is. Third card. 983. For a second, I thought we had a two card flop going. Ronnie, if you're Malele, are you getting a little upset here? Do some turn as the Jacks would have still been way ahead. interested in PLO oh, and learning about Dylan's the guy to listen to. All right, here we go. Ribouchon raising with nines. Mulally, ace five of hearts. Ribouchon quickly makes the call. And before I get overpowered by the crowd, Mulally looking for a heart. Ace five of hearts. Oh, my God. Break the set all together. 90,000 more. Oh wow! Jack six five with two hearts. Well, Ali, almost the best possible flop for him. Thirteen outs twice now. What pick? Turn card. It's the ace of spades. And Ali. A nine and a nine only will send the young American to the rail. The river card. Lots of people commenting that these events are much more fun to watch than the high rollers. Puts this in here, I mean. All in, wow. There it is. He wastes almost no time. Yeah, I mean, this is what I mean. Shmirnov can't love it, but has to make the call. All right. Chips in. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. 40 million in the middle. Ace Deuce versus King Queen. Has Ace Bag ever beaten King Queen? I don't think I've ever seen it happen. Can Smirnov stay alive and double up again? Let us know in the chat who you're rooting for. Smirnov, 59% to secure his second double up at this final table. Here comes the flop. Oh, Queen 10 9. Ribouchon immediately grabs the lead here. Smirnov needs some serious help here, or he'll be our fifth place finisher. Let's see the turn card. It is the seven of clubs. Smirnov down down to just three outs. Ribouchon about to start another party there on the rail with his friends. The river. That. There we go. He does call. make the call. And Plesu finds Ace Deuce in the big blind. Donnie, could we see perhaps some pressure applied here? <laughs> Look at this. Oh, wow. He moves all in. Obviously going to knock out Ribouchon, but. Put the cameras out. Put the cameras out. Oh, <laughs> oh my. Donnie. <laughs> Entertainment purposes. Oh my God. <laughs> I mean, that is a big play with the Karma Gods. Are we going to see diamonds here, Donnie, because of that slow roll? <laughs> oh my God. You can't make up this shit, man. You can't make up this shit. This final table just keeps delivering more and more good moments. Let's see the flop here as Ryo is once again at risk. Oh. Oh, oh my god, oh. 3, 5, 10. Oh. Always a sweat. Ooh. 
<laughs> wheel draw for Ryo, or sorry, for, for Plus Hoop to send Ryo to the rail potentially. Once again, the dealer gets a talking to. Oh, there are 60 million chips in the middle. This is massive. Oh! Four on the turn! It's a spade, though. Wait, wait. It's a spade. Wow! It's a spade. Ryo has the ace of spades. I mean, so far, the aces are cracked right now as it stands. Ace is cracked. Spades are still alive for Ryo. Or else, we're down to the final three. River card. What is it? It's a seven. And the run is over for Ryo Keep. His aces get cracked. The show is over. The pink hats will exit the room. That's a brutal, that's a brutal game. I tip my cap to you, Ryo Kneep. What an entertaining showing at this final table. He finds aces to get way back into this battle, Donnie. 60 million in the middle. What a brutal way to go out right now. Because he is up against a 14 big blind stack and a 9 big blind stack. Oh wow, Plesu puts Gunnis all in again, and Gunnis makes the call with Ace Three offsuit. Of course, when Plesu shoves every hand on it, Ace Three is going to look like Ace. All right, Gunnis is going to need this Ace High to hold up to give himself a chance to notch up his first million dollar score of his career. Let's see the flop. Nine, king, nine. Ace high still in the lead. King, nine, nine. Ace. 77% Ace. for Gunnis to win this one. Bless you looking for a queen or an eight. Turn card. Is a queen. Oh my god. A dagger to the heart of Gunnis' Ace. dreams of winning a million dollars now. One time. I'm using it. I'm only. using it. I'm using it. Ace! Ace! One time. Ace! <laughs> river card is the 10 of spades. Let me know if playing with River card. Absolutely massive situation here developing. There it is. The three bet from the Frenchman. Action back on Plasu as we wait for a count of the chips. There it is. Gonna play it in position. Just a call here from Plesuv. Huge pot developing here. Twenty-nine and a half million in the middle. Let's see the flop. King deuce five, two hearts. That is not what Ribouchon wants to see. But Donnie, do you always have to give your opponent credit for a king here, or are jacks generally still gonna be good here a good amount of the time? He can maneuver this situation without a king. Doesn't necessarily have to have one. So we'll see if Ribouchon can correctly figure this one out. I really like this bet from Plesuf. King or no king, Ribouchon must be thinking, you know, he might do this without one just to represent strength here. Ribouchon is going to make the call. No hearts for either player. So no backdoor flush is possible. 47 and a half million in the middle. King on the turn. I was going to say, Remco, a king on the turn is probably going to be very bad for Ribouchon because two on board, probably thinking less likely. Oh Plesuv my God. has one. Oh, my God. Plesuv, 95% to win this hand. How is he going to extract all the chips from his opponent? And the action is all in. Wow. Ribouchon does not like it. Great recognition from Plesuv that this move is going to make it less likely that he has a king and he does have a king. Ribouchon is going to show the jacks and he's in a whole lot of trouble. He has only two outs or this event is done. Pavel Plesuv. Can he go wire to wire at this final table? All he needs to do is fade a jack and the Moldovan will take home his first WSOP gold bracelet. The Frenchman needs a jack. 
or this thing is over. River Card, it is the three of clubs and it is all over. Pavel Plesuv wins the Millionaire Maker, takes home $1.2 million in his first career WSOP Gold Bracelet.